Leica reveals the Deluxe 7 with timeless vintage flair. Gundam Factory Yokohama plans to build a moving Gundam in less than two years. Tokyo's Yayoi Kusama Museum tops timeouts to-do list as Instagram heaven. Welcome to our daily video updates highlighting important issues in politics, business, the economy, sports, technology, and culture. I'm Anna Cecilia Regalado, and this is the Daily Post from the Jakarta Post. Leica has revealed its Deluxe 7 camera as part of Leica and Panasonic's five-year partnership, which ends in 2019. The Deluxe 7 emphasizes shooting versatility with its Leica DC Vero Sumlux 10.934mm zoom lens and a four-thirds sensor using the same 17-megapixel sensor as the Panasonic LX100 II. The new Leica model includes a 2.8-megapixel electronic viewfinder, 3-inch LCD touch display, 4K video recording at 30 frames per second. As with the Panasonic camera, the Deluxe 7 is the first in the Deluxe line that can be controlled by smartphone using the Leica Photos application, spelled F-O-T-O-S. The Leica Deluxe 7 costs 1,195 US dollars or nearly 17.5 million rupiah. During the Gundam 40th anniversary livestream, plans were revealed to build a moving Gundam through a project called the Gundam Factory Yokohama to coincide with the 2020 Summer Olympics in Tokyo. The latest Gundam is part of the Gundam Global Challenge project, with the finished mecha statue to become the third in Japan. The project announced that the moving Gundam will be erected at Yokohama's Yamashita Pier. The first ever real-life Gundam was a full-sized replica of the RX-78 II, standing at 18 meters, completed in 2009 and dismantled last year. The second Gundam, which was a replica of the RX-0 Unicorn, was raised in its place. This statue could transform from Unicorn mode to Destroy mode and still stands today in Odaiba, Tokyo. Yayoi Kusama Museum, Tokyo has top timeouts to-do list for being Instagram heaven. The museum was established as a tribute to its namesake, contemporary Japanese artist, just last year. Kusama's popular artwork includes infinity mirrors, glowing polka dot pumpkins, and hypnotic kaleidoscopic motifs. Time Out selected the finalists from a list of 5,000 recommendations in 400 destinations through a survey of 15,000 travelers around the world and curated by the magazine's global network of editors. The final cuts were judged on factors like uniqueness, authenticity, timelessness, place, audacity, and sheer cultural brilliance. Rounding out the top three spots is the House of Yes in New York and the Solar Egg in Swedish town of Kiruna. That's all for today's daily updates. Keep up with the latest news at thejakartapost.com and follow us on all social media platforms, YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram, or read our daily newspaper for more news. I'm Anna Cecilia Regalado of the Jakarta Post, signing off.